what do you observe as to the level of our rhetoric and the tone it's been taking the last couple of years in politics? Joe, I think that question is incredibly important. And it speaks to why I think it's important for me to stand proud as an independent and say that I will not be a part of what I consider to be an escalating tit for tat, the angry rhetoric, the desire to get one over on the other party, the desire to punish each other. Everyone knows I don't function like that. And I think that good people who have different opinions can get along and work together. I've demonstrated that over the course of my career, and it's returned real results for Arizona. So folks have heard me say this time and time again, we should lower the temperature. We should remove the partisanship. We should try to solve our country's problems with unity, not with division. So I call on all individuals, regardless of their political affiliation, to seek to find understanding and caring for each other, rather than to escalate political rhetoric, to engage in this name calling, which is leading to some dangerous behavior. My stand today is about joining the many Americans and lots of Arizonans, in fact, the majority of registered voters, who don't believe that any political party fits them perfectly. I did ask the majority leader to keep my committees because they're so important for Arizona's voice. I will be keeping those committees and I look forward to continuing my service working across the aisle with anyone to get stuff done for Arizona. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.